Riley, thank mm -hmm. you. So the St. Paul Winter Carnival has crowned a new queen. Marette Bylander is this year's Klondike Kate. Yeah, tradition's been going on in the capital city for decades, but the roots go back much further. And to tell us all about it, we have the very newest 2023 Klondike Kate, <laughs> Marette. Uh, thanks so much for being with us here today. And you just said, you know what, you're not a queen. No. You're Get a Klondike right. Kate. I'm a Klondike Kate. I'm a mistress of merriment mm -hmm. and fun. <laughs> with her boa, no, which hold looks on. fabulous yeah. on it does, her. It does. But, but it's tradition. Might yes. also look fabulous on someone else. Would, would you hand me the bow? Uh, I would be honored. No, Klondike oh, Kate's got to give it to you. Okay. Oh, wow. Please. Oh, my yes. oh, my. Please bestow me. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, ooh, this ooh. feels, I feel so regal right yes. now. Absolutely. Oh, my gosh. You are. Ooh. And you have your Stillwater Ponies uh, colors there, too. And that's Notice me. That. Yeah. That's me. I'm a pony. <laughs> you are a pony. So for someone who's not familiar with Klondike Kate's, walk us through the audition process to get up to that stage and how this all works? Well, um, you first of all, you know that there's a Klondike Kate out there mm -hmm. and then you think, oh, is that something I could do? Yeah. And possibly, so you ask questions. And then you become a wannabe. A wannabe. <laughs> a wannabe. <laughs> okay. And then you become, as you become a wannabe, the Klondike Kates, the past Klondike Kates, will mentor you in through the process mm -hmm. of becoming a Klondike Kate, telling mm -hmm. you how, you know, what you need to do, right. and that kind of thing. Uh -huh. And then you come to the um, process of actually auditioning. Auditioning. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. You yes. are a singer. You, you mentioned I before. I am a you, singer. Your this whole is life. Your whole really? life you've sang. Yes. And for you to sing up on that stage, what does it mean for you? How did you feel about that? It's different because the singing, my background is more in a group process, uh -huh. not so much a soloist. Right. Mm -hmm. But what an experience that oh, brings you. Bet. Oh, my goodness. And just look ahead to the winter carnival. Yeah. I mean, this uh -huh. is going to be great. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> so the second year trying. Yes. Okay. Second year trying for me. Can I, mm -hmm. can I keep this? She's got. She's got. I, she's got I a lot of things. To, oh, she needs you know, to I'll do make today. you one personally. I would promise. You really? I would. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling very no, Rick Flair. I would. Woo! Right now. This uh, is yes, I could do that. Mm. I'll get up there and sing too oh, now. Oh gosh. Yes. Well, Marette, thank you so much for coming in because I know she hasn't gotten yeah. any sleep at all today. What time did you say you went to bed last night? Uh, two thirty. Yeah. Two, ooh, see, that's yeah. right. Well, I can't. They, <laughs> they know how to party. They don't. They, they, they don't sure play around. Oh, we don't party. It's just. Yeah, we party. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at the gloves on there. Yeah, yeah, they party. St. Paul Winter Carnival gets in full swing January 26th. Be sure to mark your calendars. Thank you so much for joining yes, us. Thank you thank for you. having me. Mm -hmm.